Desist all functioning! Identificate yourself imminently! We are the Katangkot Turi! Undisputified masters of the hegemonic crux! Conquerifier of all inferior life forms! Supreme, uh, non-vincible tyrants over all quadrants of the galaxy! Katang will only answer when it suits our... inferior motive. The hegemonic crux are the undisputed masters of our home quadrant, the quadrant called the hegemonic crux quadrant. The hegemonic crux insists of six races. The rest are just for support and to build our inner structure. Um, our interstructure. Uh, our uh, uh, our building. But the only important race is the Katang! Since we added the Harika, there are six Crux races total. Let's see. The Harika, I just mentioned if I'd. The Dattak Lakpak. The, uh, Claire Conctacler. The Poxis. The Dubes. And, uh,. Let's see, that's five verses, um, now, who am I disremembering? <laughs> HA! The stupid human thinks he can trick the Katang with clever attempts to revolge classified secrets of the Crux races! Katang are much more intellectified than stupid human, much more intellectified than stupid crux races. Stupid and strange. Dak Pack, Rack Pack are strange beings with machines for brains or brains for machines, I de-recollect, but they are useful, so we do not crushify them. Deck Pack Backpack Concocticate Precursor Technography for Katang Conquest. The best planet demolishification bombs, ship-piercing missiles, torture devices. Deck Pack, uh, Deck Rack, uh, no! You can't call them Dax. If you call them Dax, they get all enragified. They make the Great Katang have to beg and plead to get new weapons. We hate that. We hate the Dak Tack Rack Rack. They must be punished. Very stupid. Uh, which Crux race are you referring to? Crux races are stupid in different ways. Huh! Pluxes are small, scrawny beings. Petty schemers who are too weak and puny to fight on the front lines, like the mighty Thud Katang. They are mere data prostitutes, glorified accountlings. We give them all the resources we conquer so they can keep track of it for us. They decide how we should spend it, plan our stratification for us, and Tell us where to go for more conquering. Yes. No! Hmm. Wait. Are you insinulabeling that the Ploxes are the bosses of the mighty Katang? That is right. The Pluxes are only important because the Katang are in alignment with them. We are too busy crushifying planets to count up the resourcification. The Pluxes keep track of all the Katang equipture and disperse it deficiently. They would be nothing without the mighty Katang! Or without their precursing vessel.
The Crux precursing vessel is great and powerfied. We only let the Pluxes fly it because we are plenty powerfied enough in our own Katang Cripplers. When it's not extruding Crux ships into Kasari star systems, it stays at our secret... Wait! You are attempting to decepticate the Katang into revulging secrets! Desist all further requirements about the precursing vessel! Very... Ha! Pathetic and stupid! The Dugs have to do all the hard work and the Katang get the most valuified of everything they build because they are too stupid. Katang attacked the Dugs in the Crux Quadrant and then the Ploxus invented a trick to forcify them to join up. The trick is a clever Katang arrangement! Uh, I disremember some Ploxus thing. Are you saying Katang are not clever? <clears throat> Very stupid. They are a scary Kasari quadrant race with huge jaws. They crushified the Crux badly when we first arrived in the Kasari quadrant, but we finally forced them to enrollify in the Crux. <laughs> All their planets are now full of weight. Are you trying to get me to revolt Crux secrets? Ask about something else. Katang will. Katang, stupid! We will demolishify you and crushificate all your world! Prepare for obliterification, squishy alien!